Am I the asshole for humiliating my friend? My friend Lisa and I, both 30s, have been close since college. We've never had serious issues before and have always confided in each other about any issues we've had. Six months ago, Lisa asked me out for dinner to a new tapas place. I'm Spanish, I miss tapas greatly, and I was excited to go. After we were done, she apologetically told me she forgot her wallet. No issue. It happens. I covered the bill, which was massive. Why are tapas only cheap in Spain? She never paid me back. This has happened several times since then. I tried asking her if she has money troubles, but she only laughed uproariously. She'd then tell me she would wire me the money as soon as she got home. She never did. (sighs) I promise this is a Reddit post that I'm reading. It is not the summary of Inventing Anna. Yesterday, we went to the same tapas place with some more friends. On the way there, I was talking to a friend of ours about how we had gone to the restaurant before, how delicious it was. I then said, oh yeah, that's when Lisa forgot her wallet and added most jokingly, and she never paid me back. I genuinely wasn't trying to start anything, but I can't deny I was miffed. I had talked to her about the money several times before, but had never gotten anything back apart from, OMG, I'm so sorry. I'll transfer it as soon as I get home. I'm really sorry. Well, Lisa obviously overheard, and although she looked kind of pissed, she said, Oh gosh, yes, that's true. I keep meaning to transfer it to you. How about I cover your bill tonight? I was super happy about this and accepted gratefully. We then got to the restaurant, and before we went in, some of us were smoking outside, and I saw her bag, which was weirdly empty. I then asked her if she had her wallet with her. She dismissed me, laughing, and said, Of course I do. I then told her, Look, I just saw your bag, and I don't think your wallet is in there, and frankly, I'm not setting a foot inside the restaurant before you show us you brought it. Gotta admit, I was really angry at that point because it really felt like she was going to use me again since I was her closest friend there. Everyone else didn't understand the context and just looked at me weird and told me to calm down. Well, long story short, we fought and it turned out she really hadn't brought it. I yelled at her that this was the fifth time in six months and that I was done paying for her only to never get my money back. I then went home. I feel guilty, but also kind of happy that I stood up for myself. On the other hand, Lisa is super hurt by the whole thing keep saying I humiliated her and that she never did it purposefully. When I asked her how it's possible this has never happened in 12 years of friendship but now has happened five times in six months, she had no answer. We are speaking but things are really tense and uncomfortable. The wire is coming. I can pay. I can pay. Your money is coming. You're not a total asshole for this. It could have been approached differently. And in our ASCON scale, that lands you around... Ask on four. You're the least severe kind of asshole, which is you probably could have approached that differently. Maybe you're an asshole, maybe you're not. It's not you should have approached that differently. It's you could have approached that differently. You were conditioned to react this way through repeated awkward situations where she had forgotten her wallet. Amy 2.0 is Lisa. So all you Lisas watching, we know that this isn't like an, an every Lisa thing. We just, we have Amy and we have Lisa and those are two isolated incidents. All the Amys, all the Lisas, you're good. You could have approached it differently, like at minimum, taken her aside and, and quietly had this conversation. However, you were completely justified in what you did because of what she's done to you before. So uh, you didn't have to do that. I don't think you're an asshole for doing that. Whatever's going on is serious enough for her to repeatedly lie to you. She loses the ability to take issue with being humiliated when she repeatedly humiliated you by lying to you and sticking you with the bill. So uh, I don't feel bad for her getting humiliated when she's been lying about something, we just don't know what it is. It is very Anna Delby-like. I can pay. I can pay. I can pay. Can't help it. It's just right there. Anyway, ask on four. You're only a little bit of an asshole.